But she asked me not to say anything. The wither infected her with something. So everything I was worried about is true. This is my fault, Jesse. Petra's wither sickness? It's because of me. There's no way this is because of you. If I hadn't choked, you would have been able to pull Petra out of that tractor beam sooner. For all we know, Petra didn't get sick until way after that. Maybe you're right. If one of our best fighters is sick... Do we even stand a chance anymore? I mean, not like we haven't dealt with some grade A problems before, but... If we stick together, we can do anything. Even something that feels impossible. It just feels extra impossible now. Then we stick together extra hard. Okay. I just kind of wish Petra would tell everybody. It would just make things easier. Hey, Jesse. You haven't found a way out of here, have you? Honestly, I haven't even been looking. I just... I just need a little alone time right now. You know what? Never mind. Hey, Jesse. I, uh, kinda need to get to that lever you're blocking. Thanks. Yep. Weird. Hey, everyone. I think I found Soren's way out. Way to go, Jesse. That's awesome. Nice sleuthing, Jesse. Sorry I wasn't more help back there. When I think back to how I ran all over Endercon looking for Ivor, I'm just happy you're with us. We'll check out the rest of the house. See if we can find Soren before he finds us. You could fit hundreds of people in here. But it doesn't look like it's being used for much of anything. Well, the music's louder. But I don't hear anyone talking in there. 
Let's see what's going on behind this door. Symphony in E. <laughs> A new composition to celebrate my newest discovery. That's him! This time, I observed Sorry. one place of block on top of another block. <laughs> what the? Rudimentary, yes, but a sign it's just of a recording. Intelligence. <laughs> I hope I'm not imagining things. Goodness After knows. all that, <laughs> he's not even here? <laughs> I, 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 I better eat something. I'm positively lightheaded with excitement. We came all this way, and for what? We're no closer to Sorn than before. Well, this record didn't turn on by itself. Huh, good point. I guess he really likes the sound of his own voice then. Maybe there's something well, useful on this record. If I can figure out what he's talking about. Hmm. I've worked up a simple set of building instructions to inspire them. <laughs> I will disguise myself and hide among them in order to observe them more closely. Huh. Huh. Oh. Hide among a them. Coming on. Hide among who? Uh. Jesse? Do you think Soren is talking about. them? <laughs> then again, everything else about this guy has been pointing to crazy. I guess everybody needs hobbies. Even if they are really, really, really dangerous. You think he's actually training Endermen to build stuff? I think he thinks he's training Endermen to build stuff. Let's look around, see what we can find out. Calls of the Endermen? Enderman Observations, Part 27. I have been watching the Endermen up close today, and I'm convinced that I may have caught them communicating. Or at the very least, two of them stood near each other for an extended period. It was very exciting. Then they wandered away. But it seemed deliberate. Maybe. I followed one of them for the next three hours. Here's what happened. The folly of pumpkins. Wearing a pumpkin may stop the Endermen from attacking me, but I remain convinced it is also altering their behavior, as if their preternatural knowledge of my presence keeps them from revealing their true natures. Therefore, I have now begun to fashion a camouflage suit that will allow me to mingle amongst these heretofore inscrutable creatures, and like a fearless explorer burning his boats to the ground upon reaching the shores of a new land. My entire cache of pumpkins has now been baked into delicious pies. Totemic Constructions of Peaceful Endermen. Hmm. Could Endermen be implored to work together? Or are they like sheep and pigs? Wandering randomly and doing things based on whim rather than higher thought processes. I've already decided that only Endermen at peace build structures. When agitated, such as yesterday, they don't seem to have any interest in building things. Only hitting me with their fists. Repeatedly. Meanwhile, peaceful Endermen will move blocks from place to place, on and on, seemingly ad infinitum, until they somehow achieve satisfaction and teleport away. Clearly, this will require further detailed observation. I am so, so lonely. You find anything useful? <laughs> Worth asking. You doing all right? <laughs> Yeah, you and me both, buddy. 
I don't know about you, but I don't want to spend any more time here than I have to. <laughs> oh, like this place doesn't give you the creeps. Keep it real, Rubes. <laughs> A joke? Heck yeah, I'd like to hear a joke. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yeah. <laughs> oh man, that is good. A little risque, but real good. Whew. You slay me, buddy. Check it out! An Enderman... suit? Either Soren's got a very unique fashion sense, or... Wait a second! Looks like a taller one was hanging there, but it's missing. Because Soren must be wearing it! This is the disguise he was talking about! You mean... In order to walk amongst the Enderman, you have to become an Enderman! It's a good thing they can't see me through this glass. Found something! What you got? It's definitely some sort of crafting recipe. But why would someone as brilliant as Soren need a recipe for a shape that simple? Because they're not for Soren. Okay, so, if Soren is using those blueprints to teach the Endermen to build, and there's a disguise missing from the stand, he must be conducting his experiment right now! Of course! The missing disguise is the one he had to put on before going outside. Which means, if we want to get to Soren, we have to go out there to do it. That leftover Enderman suit would fit me. I guess it's time to play dress up. Those instructions called for clay blocks, just like this one. I'll take this one, too. That's three I've grabbed so far. 